हेलो दोस्तों कैसे हैं आप लोग आशा करता हूं आप लोग अच्छे होंगे आज हम इस वीडियो में देखेंगे कैसे कि नॉन टर्मिनेटिंग रेकरिंग डेसिमल नंबर को नॉन टर्मिनेटिंग रेकरिंग डेसिमल नंबर को कैसे रैशनल नंबर में कन्वर्ट किया जाता है सो टुडे वी विल डू द डिस्कस हाउ टू डू द कन्वर्सन ऑफ द नॉन टर्मिनेटिंग रेकरिंग डेसिमल इट इन टू आवर रैशनल फॉर्म विथ वन ऑफ द ट्रिक Everyone, you just have to see. Here it is one of the question. It is given. Look, you all see. This is one point five bar. Given. This is the number written. One point five bar. So question is asked. This is the number written. This is the non-terminating recurring bar number. This we have to convert this to a rational number. Did you understand it or not? Did you understand the question? क्वेश्चन ये पूछा गया है जो कि नॉन टर्मिनेटिंग रेकरिंग वाला नंबर दिया गया है ये यहाँ पे एक क्वेश्चन दिया गया है यहाँ पे दूसरे वाला क्वेश्चन यहाँ पे तीसरा वाला क्वेश्चन यहाँ पे चौथा क्वेश्चन दिया गया है सो so, ये सारे क्वेश्चन को कैसे ही हम रैशनल फॉर्म में कन्वर्ट करना है ठीक है सट्रिक से फर्गेट द बार एंड फर्गेट द पॉइंट Forget the bar and forget the point. Now the whole number formed. It is 15. Everyone see carefully. First we have to forget the bar and forget the point. Now the number it is over 15. So from 15 we have to subtract. We have to subtract another whole number. We have to find out the another whole number. Just see. In the next which, which digit having the bar. Which digit having the bar. That digit you have to forget means that digit you have to delete along with the decimal point also you have to forget. So now the whole number form it is our one. First <coughs> over which digit the bar it is given that digit you have to forget. Then after along with the point also you have to forget. So then after divided by see the decimal part see the decimal part. In the decimal part, over one digit, over one digit, here it is the bar. So for which, over how many digit, there it is the bar, that number of nine, it should be written. As in the decimal, one digit number is there, and over one digit, here it is nine. <coughs> over one digit, here it is the bar. So for which, we should write only one nine. Understood? If over two digit having the bar, so two nine we have to repeat. Another thing remember, if in the decimal another digit is there, which one does not have the bar? So for which does not have the bar means you have to write that number of 0. See, this number, it is 14 divided by 9. So for which one thing it is clear that this non-terminating recording is rational form, it is our 14 by 9. See the another example. Everyone see carefully. Here it is given that 2.05 bar. So bar is over two digit means 0 and 5. Always our short trick it is. Remember, always our short trick is. First you have to forget the bar and forget the point. Forget the bar and forget the point. Now the number it is our whole number it is our 2.05. First point always you have to forget the point also the forget the bar. The new whole number form it is our 205. Second trick is everyone see. Second trick is over how many digit over how many digit the bar is there that two digit you have to delete. That two digit total you have to delete from our consideration. So it means that one you have to forget along with point also you have to forget. So after forgetting the Digit over the bar that two digit you have to forget along with the point you have to forget. Now the number it is formed, it is our two any numbers. So then the denominator, the denominator it is how much it depends upon the decimal part. See the decimal part here in the decimal part, two digits are given here it is zero and five. As two digits are there and over two digits bar are there. Only two digits and over the two digits bars are there. So for which over how many digit bar is there, that number of nine should be written. That number of nine should be written. So for which the whole number, so for which the numerator it becomes our 203 
divided by our 99. So for which its rational form it is our 203 divided by 99. See first question we discussed here it is in the decimal part one digit and over one digit here it is the bar. And here in this question over two digit here it is the bar. Next question it is three digit in the decimal part over one digit having no bar and a two digit having the bar. So this type of question how to solve. Everyone see first trick is always first you have to forget the bar and forget the point. Always forget the bar and forget the point. So whenever we are forgetting the bar and we are forgetting the point the number becomes whole number it is 3159. Second point is see second point is over which digit bar is there that digit you have to delete from our consideration. So it means over 59 here it is the bar. So for which 59 you have to delete along with the decimal also you have to forget. So it means in both the cases we are forgetting the decimal. Always we are finding the whole. Here it is the whole and the next whole number what we will obtain. Here we have to delete the digit over which here it is the bar it is there and also decimal we have to forget. So for which the number becomes 31 and divided by everyone see divided by denominator depends upon the decimal d for denominator d for decimal so for which right side you have to see decimal part you have to see here in the decimal part everyone see here in the decimal part the question is over how many digit the bar is there decimal see only the decimal over how many digit the decimal the bar is there so for which one thing it is clear over the two digits over the two digits the bar is there so for which over how many digits bar is there that number of nine we have to write and over how many digits in the decimal part having no bar in the decimal part in the decimal part how many digits are there over whom there is no bar so one such type of digit is there so for which one zero i have to give so now the number becomes, see carefully, here the difference is 9 minus 1 it is equal to 8, 5 minus 3 it is equal to 2, here it is 1, here it is 3, divided by 990. Understood, understood. So this one it is one type of a question where in the decimal one digit having bar, here in the decimal two digits are there, also both the digit having the bar. And here it is three digits. But over the two digit here it is the bar. Here I am showing you another example where you can find in the decimal here it is the four digits and two digits in the decimal having no bar and two digits in the decimal having bar. How to find? The trick is first you have to forget the bar also forget the point. Forget the bar and forget the point. So after forgetting the bar and after forgetting the point now the whole number form it is our 64213 Next trick is see next trick is over over which digit the bar is there over which digit the bar is there that two digit you have to delete that two digit you have to delete it means 13 you have to delete from our consideration and the next one it is a point also you have to forget point also you have to forget so now the whole number it is a form it is our 600 42 divided by the trick is a denominator it will be how much always the denominator depends upon the decimal part so here in the decimal part first we have to find over how many digits the bar is there here it is clearly seen that over two digits the bar is there how many digits having the bar that number of nine should be there and in the decimal part, how many digits having no bar, that number of zero we have to give. So then after you have to find out the difference, it is how much? 3 minus 2, it is our 1. Here it is 11 minus 4, it is our 7. Here it is 11 minus 6, it is our 5. Here it is 3, here it is 6, divided by 9900. How easy? Whenever you are getting the question of objective type question, fill in the blanks. 
otherwise single mark question that you have to find out check whether this one is a decimal expression it is this one whether it is true or false so within the short time means less than one minute you can check and you can find whether the non-terminating recurring is rational form it is this one or not understood perfectly i hope you uh, you understood you understood the question so you have to keep preparing with this type of a surgery okay thank you have a beautiful day